good evening, or well, in fact, good morning, good birthday morning, because it's my birthday. What's a birthday song? It's my birthday. It's my birthday. I'ma spend my money. I am officially 19. Not loving it. In fact, no, I'm not 19 because I popped out of my mother's vagina at 10 past 1 p.m. So I'm actually not 19 yet. I will be turning 19 today. Hate that age. Really boring age. Like, who wants to be 19? 18, kind of like, woo! I'm an adult. And then 20, you're like, wow, I'm 20. 19 shouldn't even exist. Do you know what I mean? I've not got much planned for today, but I just think Lewis and Flossie have something tucked up their sleeve. I just know them all too well, so I've decided to start vlogging now. Flossie said I can't get out of bed until she comes and gets me. This is so exciting because, like, usually, like, birthdays aren't a huge thing in my family. It's more like Christmas is the big thing. So, like, to be surprised, my birthday morning, I think I could, I could probably shit myself right now. I could soil my pants if I tried. Happy birthday to <laughs> Panthers, Denny Girl, Shark Boys. Well, do to zoom. <laughs> See nobody! What the fuck? Ready, everyone? Yeah. Please. I don't know my own strength. It's in the ice, like, like a blizzard. blizzard. When we drink, we do it right. Getting slizzard. I used to sing that in two and two when I was literally like seven years old. Oh, before. just terrifying love. Flossie got me um, a bottle of apple sour, so I'm doing a shot. <laughs> I haven't even eaten my breakfast yet. I'll get on with it, love. Yay! <laughs> Olivia's opening a present for me and Louie. Oh. Do you want to show you them? Oh my god, it's perfect! Yay! Yay! How did you find this? Lewis oh. did a job, to oh be fair. Oh my god! Half two now. I did have a bit of a relaxing morning just because, as I should, do you know what I mean? Now I need to get up and get ready because we are going to go shopping and then maybe out for dinner and drinks. Because now there's a curfew at 10 pm, so everyone closes, so it's not like we're going to be having a wild night. Before we go out for food, then we're going to go shopping, and I really want to buy myself a North Face coat. I think that's what I'm going to do today. That's my birthday present to myself is buy myself a North Face coat because, oh my god, the weather has switched up. It has, it's a two faced bitch. Like last week, I was sweating my tits off. I don't even have tits, that's how much I was sweating. Now it's freezing. But I'm kind of loving it a little bit. I'm really getting in that winter mood. Anyway, I need to wash my hair because she's looking a bit greasy. It has been about five days. And that's bringing us on to the next part of the video. This video is kindly sponsored by Function of Beauty. You're probably sick and tired of hearing me talk about them, but like I literally, like, they are my favorite shampoo and conditioner. So when they want to work with me, I'm like absolutely do you know what I mean? It's basically a shampoo and conditioner subscription service. It's completely customizable as well. All you have to do is fill out a two minute quiz about your hair type, what you want the shampoo and conditioner to do. You can choose the color. You can even get your name on it. And then you can like choose how often you want it to get delivered, like depending on how often you wash your hair. These are my bottles at the minute. And I usually like to have a fill bottle when I'm doing a sponsorship because it looks prettier, but like this is just, this is the real me, okay? The product itself is vegan, cruelty free. There's no toxins, parabens, sulfates, and it's actually so pretty as well. I mean, it's usually prettier when it's a bit more full, but nobody's perfect. I gotta work it again and again to like 
get it right. It just keeps my hair so nice. I'm gonna go wash my hair in a second so you can see like how like nice and like soft and fluffy it makes it. Also, you can use my link below to get 20% off your first order. And they came out with shower gel and body moisturizer recently, which is really, really exciting. And it smells delicious. I always go for the peach one. I'm a sucker for a good peach scent. Also, I use this oil every day because I've got extensions. None of the like natural oils from my scalp go down to the ends of my hair so they can get quite dry. So I always just have to use an oil and this is the one I use. It comes with your shampoo and conditioner. Well, you can choose because it's like you can choose between a hair mask, oil, leave-in treatment and stuff. But I just always go for the oil. I love a good hair oil. Right, so this is my hair before. A bit lifeless, a bit dead. And here is after. Oh my god, it's just very nice and fresh, isn't it? Very nice and fresh. I am like the queen of adjectives. But yeah, just can't recommend Function really enough. I'm such a huge fan of it. And like everyone has to wash their hair. So why not just like get it without having to leave your home? Do you know what I mean? Right, gonna do a quick bit of makeup before we head out. So let's just chat, shall we? While I'm doing my makeup, would you like that? No? Well, I'm gonna do it anyway. Let's just reflect on my past year. Well, this time last year, it was my 18th birthday, funnily enough. So basically, I just had toe surgery. You know me, I love toe surgery. I can't get enough, I've had four of them. Probably shouldn't have gone on. I've taken a full week off school to recover, which is dramatic, and it wasn't necessary, but you know me. I decided regardless, I hadn't been in school that week. I was going out my birthday. Obviously, I was going out my birthdays, don't be ridiculous. And I basically wore like really uncomfortable shoes. And I just took the dance floor by storm. I was nothing too much in my uncomfortable shoes. I had like huge like bandages on because I just had toe surgery. And it did make both of the wounds infected. It just shows how crazy my last birthday was. And for this birthday, we're literally gonna be like getting a pizza and a cocktail so like yes things have changed but you know what it's fine i think i'll still have a lot of fun today look at the necklace that lewis and flossie got me it's not the nicest thing ever like i actually couldn't believe it i've wanted this for so long i forgot to reflect okay what else did we do this year i moved oh my god i actually did a lot this year this year has definitely been the most craziest year like the most the most accomplishments i've done in a year i hit 500k i did my A-levels, which I still actually don't know what I got because I know I got BBC, but then I appealed it. So I think I'm getting like ABB, AAB. Still, I have, I have no idea and I don't know how to find out what I got. So that's interesting. Like who did I contact to be like, what did I get in my A-levels? I just don't really care. No, I should care. That's an important thing to know. If anyone can point me in the right direction of where to find out what I got in my A-levels, let me know. I will need them eventually because I do have a bit of, a, it's not really an irrational fear. I have an irrational fear that one day YouTube is going to combust and then I'm going to have nothing. But then I can just go to pilot school. I still really want to be a pilot, guys. Like I really want to. But then I'm thinking if YouTube never combusts and I'm just a YouTuber forever, I can maybe be like a private pilot. So then I'd like not have to work for like big corporate things like EasyJet. I could just work for millionaires and then right what's, what's gonna happen is i'm gonna be a private pilot for a millionaire's private jet and then one day he'll just turn around and be like you know what you're a bit of me and i'll be like i don't know and that's it and we get married and we live in Paris. so that's like my that's literally my life plan that's like my five-year plan people are like oh, what, what, do you, what do you plan to do in the future i have no idea but except that that's my only plan well so as you can tell i've just turned 19 and i'm already having an existential crisis about like what i'm gonna do in the future 18 was just such an easier time it was literally yesterday okay who wants to see my birthday outfit so i'm wearing this sweater vest from brandy mabel i think and then a wee white t-shirt and then this is actually a black dress because i don't have a black skirt but i just put it over so it looks like a skirt you know what i mean and then this jacket potentially from pretty little thing i got it ages ago i can't really remember i'm wearing this bag which is from naked fashion it was my friend emma ellingson's collection and i love it so much Right, off we go shopping, shall we? Shall we? Okay, so we went shopping, a funny thing, I forgot my camera, and also we went to one shop, went to North Face first. They didn't have the coat I wanted in stock. So that was really upsetting, I thought birthday ruined, let's go for some drinks, went, got ID'd. Remember, oh, I do not own an ID, I don't possess one of those things. So then had to come home, and here we are. It's been, it's been a movie so far. Also, can I just show you this? My um management sent me this today, how cute is it? It's a movie. It's really funny. Anyway, so we have come home now and we're gonna order some food. We're gonna order what probably what we are gonna get. Oh, we're probably gonna get like sushi or something. So we'll order something along the lines of that, won't we? Aye. Yay. And then we are gonna make cocktails. So that'll be fun. Should we do a set or shot it? I'm gonna do a set or shot it. We're gonna do a set or shot it? Yeah. Because Flossie got me apple sauce, so it'd be rude not to. I'll, I'll update you when the food arrives and when we start pouring a few drinks. <laughs> oi, oi. To the future. To the revolution. revolution. That's my joke! No, I said That's to the revolution first. It's my joke. And I just left Sean. <laughs> some more life. And some more wealth. Some more blessings. <laughs> to the near of the dragon. <laughs> to Queen Lizzie. <laughs> 
to Great Britain and the war. Oi, oi. Okay, so we actually did something quite fun. We ordered some cocktails on the library. There's a cocktail bar. So you can either order a bottle of the cocktail or a, like a kit to make it. So we thought we'd order one bottle and then one kit. So it's like a bit of an activity. So that's the bottle of mojito and that's the soda water. Which I'm assuming that's like, oh, it gives you the instructions on the thing. Oh, okay. And then we got a bottle of porn star martini. Just no, so. For 40 pounds, I would have expected a little bit more, won't lie. Was this 40 pounds? Mm -hmm. But then I guess we also got a full bottle of Prosecco with it. Oh. Oh, that's fun. You can do you see do you mix it? Well, because you know usually prosecco, one second, but you put prosecco on the side. I've never had it. I've never had prosecco on the side. What in the little shot glass? I've never had that. Are you joking? Yeah. Is that a thing? Yeah, that's what everyone comes with. That's why there's a bottle of prosecco with it. Oh, so do you put it in it? It's basically, well, it's a, it's a myth as old as time whether you shot it or put it in. Oh, almost as old as what came first. The chicken or the egg? Do you shut <laughs> Oi oi! <laughs> to the revolution! To the chicken? Or the egg? Oi oi! Mo, they gave us a full bio crushed ice. That is so exciting. It's like McDonald's ice. I love Mackey's ice. Oh, I love McChicken sandwiches from McDonald's. Who wants a, um, who wants a fridge tray? I actually got a big Sainsbury's shop today. I've got the classic garlic. I've got three vegan paradises. These are the best things ever. Lots of almond milk. Lots of coconut yogurt. You know me, love coconut yogurt. Some satay chicken Kiev. Oh my god, in my last video, I was like talking about like what kind of things I like to eat for dinner because you know all my peeps are moving on recently going to uni and I thought I'd give you some inspiration. And I was like, love me a chicken nugget wraps, that take Kike, chicken tikka and all this and everyone was like oh my god she's not vegan anymore I am vegan it's like vegan chicken kebs they are delightful honestly if I was gonna recommend you chicken kebs try that was vegan I'm gonna tell you to try the MS one it is the MS garlic kev you you wouldn't realise it's not real chicken it's sensational Bossy have you ever tried it? I have not no oh my god I'm gonna have to get you a garlic kev someday oh, thanks, garlic kev bit of soup potato mash my soup potato mash yeah 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 should I fart? Should I? Yeah. Is it the kind of vibe? I mean, why not? I mean, it's my birthday. Mm-hmm. It is, it's like... Oh, I farted. Guys, I can't find it! I just wanted to show you what we got for dinner. I got some cucumber maki, you got cucumber and avocado mm. maki. What'd you get? Some sushi, sushi. duck spring rolls. Oh, <laughs> some prawns and <laughs> I got spring rolls as well, very excited. I think this is yours. Okay. Okay, so we decided let's play a quick say or show it just because we're we're getting drunk for no reason. We're in the flat. It's my birthday. Okay, let it be. Let it be. Let it be. Has anyone had an STI or STD before? No. no. Cushion. <laughs> no. Uh, say. I do too. You Me do too. too. Trust well, me, I'm more about dogs. Shirt. I have two. Watch. I feel like they'll smell. Least favorite UK YouTuber. I'm Morgs. I don't know any yeah. UK YouTubers. The only ones I know are the ones I'm friends with. I like Zoella. And Zoella and Alfie. <laughs> and Zoella wrote Molly's favourite. She's an angel. I used to be obsessed with Zoella. Like, you yeah. know, like Poppy and Sean. Like, I was obsessed yeah. with all them as well. I think we need one that's shot where the digits in your bank account. Apple sours for you. Coming up. Should I take one? Fine, I'll take one. I'm oh my god, I thought you were gonna say it. I'm only taking one because you two are taking one. Take one if you don't. don't if take you don't one. want to, just yeah. say it. I'll just. Well, I said it in a video before, so say and it, I haven't changed. Yeah, so say it. Five. <laughs> Are you laughing at me? No, I didn't. <laughs> I'm just a little 18-year-old girl. I would have answered if it was five, to be fair. Oh, so yours is what, seven? Eleven. <laughs> <laughs> Tori. What's the number one thing you would never want your parents to find out about? Here you go. Florence Pitchers. What's the worst date you've been on? No. One time I was ditched an RN to go play snooker. Oh no, one time I went to meet up with my like ex-ex-boyfriend and he bumped into his friends whilst we were together and asked me to go home. Last person you hooked up with. Sorry, can we just like appreciate that I cannot do a shot and this is apple sauce, it's like 10% or something and look how pathetic I am and I like try to hide it that I finished like half the shot and it just doesn't work. That was so cool. Why do you read that so cool? I read yours. Tell us who your most recent DM is with and what it says. Mine is my lash lady saying happy birthday to me. Mine is my friend Reza who said laughing emoji. <laughs> Mine is a boy from my area. He said, hey Fossey, long time no see. How are you? I just moved oh. to 
Brixton area, you live around here, right? Be great to see you. Right, that is all we're gonna do for the say or shot. I feel like that's probably the end of my birthday vlog because it is, what time is it? Half nine. <laughs> Someone called the police. What a sad little life. Who Hi. thinks my teeth are white? Because I paid 800 pounds for them. <laughs> Did you actually? I paid 800 pounds for the white. <gasps> really? What? It was 800 pounds <laughs> to get two hour of whitening and a year's worth of gel. You could have used my, my gel. Well, who's a whiter? Bearing in mind, I've not whitened mine for a year. I've not put any whitening products on mine for a year. Well, there's no need to fucking brag about it. To, to the, the revolution! revolution. Oh, yeah. Do I need to sip there? Oh, sorry. Eyes. <laughs> I spoof. Oh. I feel I'm sick and I'm going to die. Like the die shining. Okay, that's the end of the vlog. Sorry, I feel like it was so boring. Like, I literally didn't leave my flat. I left it for about 10 minutes. Like, it wasn't a very eventful birthday, but, like, it was never going to be an eventful birthday, you know? It's a COVID-19 birthday. It's a COVID-19 19th birthday. Hmm. <laughs> Shut up, Olivia. Okay, bye. Sorry it was boring. <laughs> Please still love me. I love you. Loving your face. Missing your face. From the Shard. London.